It's been a couple of weeks since I've shared an update, and I have a traffic advisor now. I've also put some resistors in line to dim these lights in, and they no longer shine up on the roof. But I have a traffic advisor, and uh, it is pretty cool. back to the cap and permanently mounted it so that I don't have a wire coming through the door anymore. Uh, backup strobes are still working. But this is pretty bright. And uh, just to show you the inside. It's mounted with Unistrut which seemed like the most logical as anything you can commercially buy. Yeah, looks good. Phase two, uh, I'm in like phase 12 already, but phase two is some new lights uh, behind these windows and then some new lights on the top. And then uh, some new lights here in the bunker. Well, the traffic advisor project is something I've been working on for a while now. There's 10 lights. Um, they're actually 3,000 lumens a piece, um, and they're, uh, they're LED floodlights. Uh, I bought them for $5 a piece on eBay, and uh, they're uh, 6,000 uh, color temperature, and then I added a gel in front of them. Um, and they're all mounted inside of an aluminum enclosure um, with a piece of Lexan, in front of the windows. Uh, my friend Ben helped me machine the inside of the enclosure down a little bit um, to fit the lights inside of better, but um, it seemed to work great. They're all sealed in with silicone. Uh, it's completely waterproof. I may end up putting it on top of the roof of the truck at some point instead, and they have just barely fit inside the enclosure, um, but they fit well, and they're all held in with um, with a bunch of M4 metric screws, and uh, and they work fine. I haven't had any problems with the lights yet. Um, so I mentioned there's 10 lights. The controller only controls eight uh, lamp circuits, so I decided to combine the outside two uh, lights, and I had to create a custom wiring harness for this. Uh, I needed nine circuits. Ended up uh, adding 14 circuits to the truck, so I have some spares for the next project, and. Uh, and then it turned out really good, but like I said, it was really tight fitting inside the enclosure. And the enclosure is a black um, ballast strip made by SSRC Theatrical Products. Um, this is the drawing for the um, traffic advisor. I ended up at originally designing it with some switches. Um, the advisor is about twice as bright as anything you can buy. It's uh, 24,000 lumens, draws 16 amps, um, and it can work at 12 or 24 volts. But uh, yeah, pretty basic.